up guys, Mono from 99 here. Another banger, another video. Um, a lot of people loved the older video that we did, the first video that we did uh, with my man here. And we wanted to do an updated video and show, you know, the new heat, the new stuff that he's got. A lot of people uh, don't know, you know, that there's still people out here who appreciate OG shoes. It's not all about hype. And um, how old are you again, man? Uh, I'm 18. Now. He's 18. So a lot of people think, you know, that the younger generation, the people that are 18 or, or younger are just into the hype, but there's people yeah. out like you that appreciate the OG, you know, the OG shoes. And I love seeing that. A lot of people love seeing that too. So stay tuned, guys. I can't wait for you guys to see this video. Let's get into it. Um, what's the first show you want to start with? Well, let's start going with the double. Let's start with the hair. You know, the, the, this is just a classic pair, you know. You gotta have this collection. You know, I have two pairs, you know. I like, I like, I like the pairs, you know, it's really intricate. Yeah. Every, every pair is different from like, the tongue. Mm -hmm. You know, this one's kind of faded, but this one look, look more green. Yeah, what year is this from? Um, specifically this one is from, uh, 91. 91? Yeah. Cool. So yeah, I have two pairs of these. Uh, this one's 11, uh, 0.5 I think, or so. And this one is like a 10. Yeah, 10 and a half. I wore these recently, like for um, New Year's I think. Nice, nice. Yeah, yeah I remember you showed me a picture yeah. of them. Um, I always, the thing that I always liked about them is the tongue. Yeah, the tongue, same here. I'm in love with the tongue, like the colors are like different. Yeah. I remember the ones that came out with the CBT pack or yeah. 2015. Or yeah, for sure. I. That's one thing that I always uh, loved, and I remember seeing, especially in the movie Space Jam. Oh yeah, it, it's just those those it's the aqua colors. Yeah, you know, everything, yeah, everything's everything. different for sure. Yeah. More vibrant. Um, you know, it was another like I recently acquired these really cheap. You know, they're ninety one infrareds. You know, quality. You know, it's clean. You know. Yeah, for but sure. Although like, the metal's falling apart, you know, but you know that's. That's what you get with OGs, you know. That's, you know, that's what you get with Yeah, OGs, for sure. You know? I would say one thing I love seeing them like in that form. I know a lot of people yeah. hate it. They're like, oh, it's ruined, it's yeah. crumbled. But I feel like a lot of people don't appreciate what they have. Yeah. And what year was this from again? Uh, this one is 90, uh, but they all usually release like 90, 91. Mm -hmm. But yeah, that's what the tag says, so, you know. Nice. Yeah. This pair, I do have two pairs of these too. This is the bigger size than my size. The other one's a smaller size. Mm -hmm. Another little size. You know, we got found out if we've hit on this before, but you know. Yeah, I remember sample. those from last yeah. videos. A lot of people were asking me about these because they're like, yeah. oh, those released. These are the sample pairs. Yeah, these are from 80, no, 98. So 98. these are the original ones. So. Yeah. yeah. These were the samples. So a lot of people don't realize. They were before Jordan Brand or Nike or Adidas before they actually release a shoe. It was just an idea. This was yeah. just, you know. Though before they even release one, they have to make samples of it. So a lot of people didn't know that this was actually a sample. This is what not this wasn't what released to the public. It looks very similar, but like I said, there's always samples before they yeah, actually Yeah, We did the get shoe. something similar with the white song. Yeah. Back in 04. Mm -hmm. And then what was it, twenty thirteen? Yeah, so? it's back when they released those. Yeah. But I mean I think the OG's better. Yeah, of course. Always, right? always quality. Yeah. A lot of people don't realize that with quality with OGs, they definitely yeah. were doing something something different. So I, I absolutely love those. Yeah. And then, you know, we'll go inside with the boxes. You know, these were also recently required. And we got the purple. Nice. You know, what year are these from? These from 94. 94. Yeah, these, these are really clean for what they are, you know, no, no yeah. really up for cracking, just, you know. I love nines. I feel like, especially with the weather we're having now here in Iowa, it's, it's they're, perfect. They're like boots, man. Yeah. I always wanted to get the, uh, the boom with the tractions. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I know what you're talking about. Those, and they also recently came out with, the, um, Oh, they're like supposedly like a PE colorway. Oh yeah. You know, with the yeah. 3M and stuff. The ones, they usually came out of the boot too. Yeah. But now they came out with the red. I think that I love seeing like OG colorways with like kind of a new twist to yes, it. Yes, I did too. I know that uh, the nines released with the olive colorway, but they were like the boots. Oh, so yeah. they had traction especially made for yeah. the winter time. Uh, what's another pair you wanted to get in? So. Um, These are uh, some sample 
1992 uh, Bugs Bunny 8. These are sale salesman samples. Nice. Like the size tag, the, the box. Mm -hmm. We should have came in these, like you know, the one that, like the tens and eights came in. Yeah. Like those should have came in those boxes, but we got flip boxes like the sixes, mm -hmm. sevens, and the eight, and the uh, fives. Yeah. This is, you know, this is one of the samples that acquired from eBay. Nice. Yeah, these are. Just fall apart like crazy, yeah, you know. for sure. So this is not what released to the public. This is no, a sample it's, pair. Yeah, this is a bit better quality, I say. Mm -hmm. And then the Jumpman's a little different. I don't know, but mainly just the sticker inside says it. Mm -hmm. And you know the box and everything. Nice. Yeah, this is like from what I was told, this is like a pre-release. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So like, what year was were these from? Um. Well, they were from 93, oh, so, okay. and the tags in 92, 91, I don't remember. Too sure it was uh -huh. well back since I've actually seen both of them. Yeah, for sure. Do you like going back, or just kind of um, leave, them, leave them where they're at? Kind of both, I mean, I like to revisit some, sometimes here and there. Yeah. But yeah, like, sometimes I'll be like, oh, I forgot I had these, yeah. you know, or oh, I want to wear these, you know. Mm -hmm. and it all depends on my feel, you know. I'm going to open something else, you Find for it. sure. Yeah, or someone asked for a picture. I'm like, yeah, sure, I'll show you. It's nice, it's nice. Yeah. Um, another pair I think we should touch on is, is these, you know. We got another sample 13 OG from um, probably 87 or not 87, 98. 98, 97. Okay. My bad. This is the uh, He Got Games. And you can just see just the, the shoe itself. Mm -hmm. If you look at it closely, the quality of the leather, yeah, the leather, different. I should say. I can't even talk, man. I just see stuff <laughs> like this is is honestly super, yeah. super dope. Yeah, and the only reason it makes it a sample is the box. Uh, you know, yeah. It really comes in, in these. Uh -huh. I'll show you. This is this pair is from China. Uh -huh. So this is the China version. And the quality, just, just touching it, you can definitely tell. That it's it's something special. It's something different. Yeah. We got we get this box with that one, and this is the regular release. And a lot of people don't realize too when 13s get to a certain point, they start fogging up yeah. like this because of age. And also the the the, the suede starts shagging up. Yeah, I mean don't like that, but you know. I don't <laughs> know. Yeah, this this pair is dead stock. Yeah. It's talking to you. Yeah. I know a lot of people, I want to show them how the bottom of it looks like, mm -hmm. if you don't mind. Like that part? Uh, no. What, oh, I, the actual one? Yeah. Because so, a lot of people are like, what What technology does Jordan Brand actually have inside their shoes? So this is what they uh, have. This is what it looks like, just the bottom itself. Um, and a lot of people don't know that this actually came from, they were trying to incorporate like if Jordan was a panther. Oh, yes, yes. This is like the eye and these are like the... The whiskers yeah. and stuff like that, yeah. This right, right here is, is the paw print itself. It's super, super dope seeing stuff it's like unique. that. Yeah. yeah. I like the idea. It's like, it's like with the sixes, did you know that there's like this hidden message? The, the 23, sixes. right? Yeah. Yeah. There's the two to three MJ and stuff. I didn't know that. I learned that from uh, Jumpman Boston. Yeah. Yeah. That. I'm like, that's awesome. Subtle awesome. details like yeah. that, I think, is what a lot of shoes now are, are just missing. Yeah. Especially, like I said, again, quality, I have to go back to it. Yeah, and most of the shoes don't have story now. They're yeah. just, or oh, just a collaboration or just a random color that you yeah. know, really want to come out with. For sure. I mean, I, I just I just love seeing and oh, hearing yeah. stories like that, yeah. for sure. For sure, yeah. Same here. You know, another, another one that I think we don't get appreciate yeah. is the military. Mm -hmm. you know, this is where boy wears, but I'm wearing the snow, you know. Yeah. It's, the, the leather gets weird when it's wet. It's dirty. I had a lot of people ask me, because we did touch up a little bit on these. They wanted to see them more actually in depth and mm -hmm. detail. Um, a lot of people were telling me like, yo, are those really the OG versions? Yes, they yes, are. Yes, they are. You the can really tell. Neck, ear, back. The leather's different. The suede. The netting. Everything is different. The tongue. The quality on it is really good too. I'm hoping, I mean, I don't know, I, I just, I feel like whenever Jordan Brand releases like, a old, like re-releases OG sneakers, I always find a way to mess it up, so that's yeah. why sometimes, sometimes I'm just, I don't release it. Yeah, yeah I'm just scared. <laughs> I've seen, I've seen some promising pictures of like recent pairs that I've seen, like the shape of them, I've seen some pretty, pretty good shape, like yeah. the, 
supposedly Halo 3 is where they yeah. come out, supposedly the, the 3 is where oh, yeah, yeah. the Chicago ones were about. Uh -huh. Those those have really good shape. Yeah, there's a lot of people yeah, those, were telling me. Yeah, they have good shape. Uh -huh. I got them they think we nailed it, I think. Yeah. So I'm like, I told my friends, what do you think they're doing? You think yeah. the friends are coming up? So it might be, yeah. I, mean, just... I, I know a lot of people were definitely kind of skeptical when there was rumors that the, mm -hmm. the threes were going to come out, like, like tablet threes. Mm -hmm. um, but the shape was one thing that the first oh, thing yeah. that caught my eye was yeah. like, yo, this looks like an OG shoe. Yeah. Um, you have the OG threes right there. Well, these are not OG, these are 94. 94. Yeah. yeah. Uh, the, oh, 88 ones. 88. Really hard. There yeah. you They're go. really hard to come by. Have... Even this type of shape is like, yeah. I feel like they nailed it. Yeah, the, but I feel like this, I think this print was modified. Mm -hmm. The low, low, lower elephant print, but yeah. I like it. The 94 has a little, little, tub back, little yeah. tad bit thicker, a little taller, mm -hmm. but otherwise, can't go wrong with a 94 yeah. or 88. This this pair especially, like, I, the tongue is what gets me a lot. A lot of people don't realize, even when you touch it just like that. It's, it's quality, it's, it's, it's leather. Yeah, I wish, I mean, I don't know, I wish I, I could acquire a pair of these because these are so fire. A lot of people don't realize exactly what, you know, what goes into actually making a shoe. I think back then they really, really were thinking about it for sure. I feel, I mean, even even if there's blue stains, it's still look nice. Like, yeah. You can't compete with the quality now. Uh, sticking with the 94, I do have the 87 that I'm fixed on. Uh -huh. But, you know, these are DS from 94. 1994, wow. Brand new, never worn. Nope. Definitely don't see that. Yeah, ever. you definitely don't see that. Well, I, I, I got these for a DL10. Yeah. These My are DL10. so clean. And, and, and they're wearable too. Yeah. But no doubt so I'm like, Yeah. <laughs> These are so dope. Yeah. Um, I remember him, you know, he did I feel like he, he didn't play that much in these, obviously, because of his injury, but man, these are so, yeah, so they're, dope. They're insane, because, and people say they're moon boot. Yeah. I, I don't think so. Man. They're comfortable. They're comfortable, yeah. I've had, I have the blue ones with the MJ thing and stuff in the back, the Converse pack. Yeah. It was comfortable. And I, I want to get a pair now. <laughs> yeah. To wear it because I don't have World War Two. Mm -hmm. Yeah, these are so dope. Yeah. I agree with you. Just a classic color, like, you know, the white, black, and red. Yeah, for sure. I think we get with a lot of shoes now. You know, it's the main color. The OG color was yeah. for sure. Yeah. And sticking with the '94s, we have '94 <laughs> red ones right here. Nice. Yeah, I, I, I wear these too. I think. This is a good pair to wear, you know. Mm. For so actually talking about these, a lot of people, if you don't mind, mm -hmm. um, we had a video up. We still have it up, of course. Um, shout out to Vice. The guys over at Vice had a sample version oh, yeah. Yeah. of the threads. And seeing these, yeah, yeah, um, yeah. This is crazy. Uh, I just wonder how much they sold, you know. Yeah, they they didn't. They just they said a ballpark. They didn't tell anybody, but pretty sure they they sold for a pretty penny. Um, especially looking at like a, a pair from back in the day, like the sample versus this, yeah. the tongue I have to say was a lot thinner in this yeah. one. The other one was super fat. Yeah, this one is like a new buck, like the 2001s. Yeah. One of my friends, a lot of people get them confused with the 2001s. They're like, oh, nice 2001s, they got 94s. Yeah. Because, you know, the, the, the thing is a little bit taller. You have the size tag on the side. Mm -hmm. Old ones don't have that. These old ones have the, the, out of, out of, out of 100. Yeah, but, yeah. You know, and then the shape, the L, it's more of an L, this is more of you know, weird shape. Yeah, it is a weird shape. Looking at it now, if you kind of look at it, mm -hmm. it is, is, it is a super, super, super weird, uh, weird shape. I love it though. Yeah, it, it it's, so, you know, it's really OG, it's tall. Yeah, what do you think? Cause they said they're releasing a pack. Um, oh, the one with the yeah. airships? Yeah. Yeah, I, I think, I like it. The airship's kind of weird looking to me, uh -huh. but I I think they still got it. They noted yeah, it. They noted it for sure. And the ones look very promising. Yeah. I might, I might, I don't know, man. I want to get a pair. Yeah. <laughs> Those are super dope. I yeah. love them for sure. Same thing. We also released the reverse bread. Yeah. In, yeah. in that new shape that we're getting. They said supposedly that they were going to up the price on um, yeah. retail just because of that shape. I don't know about I don't that. Know, yeah. I remember back then they. They were not that expensive, so why should they be expensive now? Yeah, and, and 
Look, it says 125. Right? There you go. Jordan yeah. Brand, why can't we why can't we get to 125 again? There was one that said like 50 bucks. Yeah. <laughs> why can't we get that now? Um another thing, another pair. I think we should definitely touch on. Z. I'm wearing the the, the re-release yeah, of that. Re -release. Oh. Man, these are so so sick. And have you seen the what the ones that yeah. come out? They mm -hmm. have the 23. Yeah. But I think it looks a little wonky on the 23. Yeah. The thin, but they got it. Yeah. This is this one has neck here, but this this you can't get better than this. Yeah. This is just quality itself. Yeah. It's it's super dope because I'm wearing the the new version of it without the Nike Air. But of course, the Nike Air, it's, it's, yeah. it's what you have to go for. Yeah, I, and it's like the new ones that came out with the Bellar one. Yeah. Without the laces, I think they should have came out with the laces. Yeah. Um, It's a lot different from this one too, because this one, with even the padding on here, it's not as much padding yeah. on this one. With that one, we get more of a glass thicker leather. Yeah. This is more of a Durabux. I don't mm -hmm. know what the, com I don't know what material it is, but it's weird. I've tried to look up, or see what materials felt back then, mm -hmm. how it really felt, you know, because this is dried out, you know, this yeah. is old. I want to figure out if it was, did it feel like leather back then? Yeah. Or does it feel like what I'm feeling right now? Mm -hmm. For you sure. Because I've had conversation with some friends and they said that the shoes will fall apart, mm -hmm. you know, once wearing, because he, he had a couple pairs and they would just fall apart. Yeah. Cause I, do, I do agree with that too, because sometimes I feel like of course, over the over the years and years of shoes releasing, they probably did feel different at first when they came out than what they feel like now. But I mean, you don't really know. Yeah, yeah, it's all mystery. You know, new pairs keep popping up. Mm -hmm. Like the new pair of ones I saw. I'm not sure if it's real, but it was like a purple OG one. Oh yeah, yeah with the white. Yeah. Like, I was like, when is those released? Yeah. 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 <laughs> what are those? For sure. It'll jump more to the 2000. You know. With the bling, bling blings. Yeah, I, I don't know. This pair, I, I love the quality. Mm -hmm. I, I love the shape, color, everything. It's different. No patch. We get an actual stitch jump. Actual jump right there. Yeah. I did decide to make it a little different by making a red air bubble. Nice. You know, just give it a little color pop from the yeah. white. A lot of people don't realize because these are these are different from. The actual pure money. Yes, yeah, so the, the pure money has the actual netting. Mm -hmm. This has like the Columbia just holes punched in. Yeah, and of course these these tips right here. I love that the waffles. Yeah. It's yeah, super it's, super yeah. dope. The shoes are so clean. I, I yeah, I, I can't describe them. Yeah, these are cocoa white for sure. Yeah. <laughs> I love seeing stuff like these, this. These are like diamonds. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Are those your size, right? Yeah, you know, I try to acquire my size so I can wear. So you can wear? Yeah. And if I can, you know, I just I can't. You know? Yeah, because I know a lot of people, they'll just buy them and they're like, nah, I would never wear them. But you actually like to wear your shoes, so yeah. that's really cool. Yeah, like moments when I don't, when I ain't able to wear them, it's yeah. stuff like this. Like, these are some Ray Allen promos. Uh, these are size 12.5, so I'm not a 12.5. Yeah. Yeah, these. This is just a pair I've always wanted. You know? Yeah, I've but seen pairs like this go for a lot, a yeah, lot of money. Pretty penny now and then. Yeah, and they're yeah. super, super dope to see for yeah. sure. And so many fake out there in the mm -hmm. market. You know, this pair for sure is because it's promo. Uh -huh. But uh, it sucks with all this fake stuff. Yeah, know? for sure. I love. I don't know why, but I just I love when there's like a different logo on a 13. Mm -hmm. Um, just because, like, it's it's setting a statement yeah, that they were. Yeah, it, it, it gives a different look. Yeah. There's uh, Jason Kidd, BEs. Yeah. All these crazy, you know, 13s coming out here, the organs, all yeah. that stuff. Look nice. You know, just the green. I like, I like green. Yeah. Because you don't see a lot of green Jordans. And yeah. Do, you know, they look nice. Like, this one is presentable. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, and speaking, like, with other sizes that I hop around with, because, you know, this is another. Game one pair of Ray Allen, they're uh, 19s, SE. These are game one, that's what the description said. Yeah. And, you know, who wears a size 14? <laughs> yeah, like for sure. 
I also got matching hat signature with it. Right now, authenticated. <laughs> yeah, for sure. That's super dope. Yeah. But here's another OG. You know, the Royals. This happens to a lot of yeah. lot of uh, of OG shoes. Because mainly it's just painted over. Yeah. It's just not actual leather. Mm -hmm. I know. I was talking to a buddy of mine who we did a video on Chris Thomas. Um, his pair, he has it. like when you go like that, it's starting to crunch up. Oh yeah, that's it's the padding. Yeah, yeah. Mine, no crunchy collars. Yeah. Oh, co you know, no crunchy collars right here. But I'm happy. Kind of crunch, but yeah. You know, I see people soak them in like there's you know, the shoeing or yeah. whatever, just to soften it up. But I don't know. I feel like I'm, I, yeah, I was gonna say. I think <laughs> I don't know. I would probably be really, really careful with doing stuff like that yeah. for sure. Yeah, I'd turn like too much poly. Mm -hmm. I don't, I don't know how they do it. <laughs> yeah, I don't either. Um, Paul, another pair we can touch on. Paul, oh, indeed. You know, another, another classic all white pair. You know, you get the receipt and everything with them. You know, the classic green. Those are yeah. so, so fire. Yeah, I, I wore them and they're starting to fall apart, so I stopped wearing them. But, you know, you can't go wrong with it. Yeah. I seen. I've heard they're gonna come out. Uh -huh. I've heard they're gonna come different a little bit, but I just don't want them to come out. Yeah. Picture, you know. <laughs> These are so dope. I didn't realize what like this. You can actually kind of see yeah, it through it's the wall. Yeah, it's translucent. Isn't that actual solid? Yeah. That's why I like these. It's more like the the fire rays and stuff. Yeah. These are so 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 yeah. dope. It's a nice pair of seeing mm hand. -hmm. To be honest, and the aging because the character. Yeah. I know uh, Kais, Kais Omar on YouTube, he wore his pair in the first, I think it was like the first or second time he wore it. Yeah, they fell apart. Yeah, they yeah. fell apart. Mine lasted like a couple weeks. Mm -hmm. so. What's that? These are from 2000, right? Uh, 2004. 2004, yeah. nice. These yeah. are so dope. Yeah, and, and you, just, you just gotta have a classic. Yeah. Pairs and you. It's, it's classic, you know. <laughs> it's a nice. Oh, I didn't uh, show that, but the back of it is a chrome oh, uh, yeah. jump man. Yeah. Yeah, I love that too. That's so nice. You get that with the bling. Yeah. yeah. A lot of other classic Just little colors. details like that yeah. really uh, makes the shoe for sure. Unique. Yeah, that's something that I didn't know that the actual the waffles were translucent. I thought they were just solid. Yeah. yeah and that's why I also like them because it's, it's, it's a really cool color. Mm -hmm. It's different. You know, we got another one. Another. Which is the Carmine. Mm -hmm. This is a classic. Who doesn't like Carmine? Yeah, who doesn't? If you don't, you're crazy. Yeah. <laughs> and just just seeing these on MJ's feet is awesome. Like in the pictures from the ND and stuff. For sure. Awesome. I was like, how much I could just wear them? Yeah. Like, you know, you can't. <laughs> yeah, these aged. I mean, I love seeing this aging just because I feel like it adds a lot of character. Yeah, you can see that they're actually OGs. Yeah. yeah so and, and like touching back to the quality, like this, this, this material held up really good. Yeah. It's still soft, not dry, not cracking on us, anything. Yeah. Otherwise, the Durabuck is. But of course, yeah. That's 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 you know that's what they expected with yeah. Durabuck, but yeah, the quality of course is super plush. Yeah, it's, Love seeing that right there for sure. Nike Air, who doesn't love seeing that? <laughs> yeah. Nike Air has gone crazy. Oh yeah. I definitely agree. We we need to we need to bring that back more. I know there was a time when they had the they, they named it the remastered series. Yeah. There was someone at Jordan Brand and Nike that did not want to bring back that Nike Air for a long time. Yeah. And, and I also do kinda of see that too because you know and I don't know. I feel like they're gonna ruin it. Yeah. I just don't want to ruin yeah. such a classic pair. <laughs> yeah, for sure. They've done it to us so many times that I just don't want it to happen again. Yeah, I, I understand that. And also, as a collector's viewpoint, sometimes when they do re release, they kind of like ruins the value of them. Oh, yeah. And like, or like when certain instances happen, yeah. they rise they up. They rise up, that yeah. is true. Like the Kobe, the, what happened with Kobe, you uh -huh. know, poor guy, you know, sad. But with the seven, the the PE seven, mm -hmm. they went for twenty four thousand dollars. Yeah, I saw that. I'm like, that's crazy. Yeah, I mean, what what do you what do you think about that though? Because I know a lot of people. There's a lot of controversy yeah. with, with well, that. 
it's like pizza on cake set. No. This is not gonna be anymore. Yeah. What about the people who actually want to have a more memorabilia from them? Uh -huh. Just cause. What's up? You're not gonna be able to get it anymore uh -huh. just cause someone says no. There's respect. No, I want to respect him by getting something from him. But from, I see from somebody who really liked them. Oh, yeah, this respect was it. You know, it, it all depends. You know? Yeah. It's, it's pretty touching. Yeah. For Hopefully sure. Hopefully everything just get better from, you know, these months on and stuff. Yeah, do you think that, like, after a while, because I know a lot of resale shops, even, mm -hmm. um, like Jay, Jay from uh, UN yeah. and other people. Soul they, Supremacy. Yeah, Soul stuff. Supremacy. They all took their pairs off. They yeah. said, we're not selling. And also Nike, too. Yeah, Nike. Yeah. And when I saw it, I'm like, that means, yeah, that's kind of big. Yeah. Life. Nike's getting into it, you know? Yeah, for sure. I was I was super, super surprised when Nike actually came out and said, hey, we're yeah. not going to freeze it. Because yeah. they wouldn't, I don't think they would have ever done that, for sure. Yeah, you, you thought they were taking advantage. Yeah. Like, we're gonna, re yeah, yeah, we're gonna release a whole bunch of stuff, but that's that's definitely crazy that they did that in the first place, for sure. Yeah, and that's gonna uh, keep them respect. Yeah, so. for sure. So we're gonna move on to another five. I think this one is another super classic pair of uh, Everybody got to have, I say it's the great, you know, we have OG great, you know, 94. I do keep these sealed, yeah. you know, keep them all. A lot of people asked too in the first video that we did, why do you keep them sealed? Well, just to keep, keep them inside the mm -hmm. air, you know, don't keep the moisture in, you know, yeah. keep them out or Whatever. I don't really like when people put the silica packets because it yeah. really dries up. The I material. saw. I know Jumpman Bostic. I want to yeah. say he put some uh, silica packets in there. Yeah, I don't know because, like for instance, with these, if you would have put the silica packets, the leather would have darker. Mm -hmm. It would have aged more. For sure. Man, these you know these are super classic clean pair. You know you, you gotta have this. You know, super icing, OG, wearable. Mm -hmm. A lot of people were asking me what's so special about these. If you want to turn around, just it's that man. Literally, that's why <laughs> you you're not gonna get to know. Yeah, you're gonna get that that jump man. Yeah, what year are these from? Um, these are from ninety one. Ninety one or ninety? Yeah, and again, I want to go back to the quality of it. Like the leather, you can really, really tell that the craftsmanship was there, and just the quality and the material, it was just there. Um, again, Phoenix wanted to be here, he couldn't be here. <sighs> he loves, 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 loves this pair. Yeah. And uh, I know, I always, I'm, I'm gonna send him a picture too when we get uh, done recording. Yeah, it, I'm like, it's, hey. it's a nice <laughs> pair. Like it's, yeah. it's so clean, it's so icy. It, the, it's like the colors. Mm -hmm. Everything is a pop. It just pops. Yeah. I feel like the colors back then were more vibrant. Right? Yeah, yeah, for sure. I love seeing stuff like yeah, that. Yeah, I do too. Like, especially like with pairs that you know usually are more beat up. Yeah. I like to see them um, in a good condition and see, oh yeah, they actually still do exist in a good yeah. condition. Um, also, another pair I would like to touch on would be my Maroon 6s. Uh -huh. Also, th this pair is a lot. MJ didn't really play in this. Yeah. It's one of those like SE colorways I say. Yeah. But I love this color. You don't see this popping up in, like a lot. Yeah. I wear these a lot, you know, all oh, dirty and stuff, you know, where you, I wear my kids. Yeah, know. for sure. I know I we spoke about it last time. You said you did like the re release version. Mm -hmm. I did like the re release version. That was nice, but you know, I have it the OG, has to be OG, right? Have, <laughs> yeah, I have the OG. Why get why get the new Yeah, version. for sure. So we're transitioning now to this part. And then we're going back to the you know, samples. We do have JVC samples, size 8.5. You know, you really see these more like in the bigger sizes, big, like 12.5 and up. Because mm -hmm. you know, these were these to the, the Durban Classic team. Yeah, for you know, sure. They're basketball players, so they're tall stuff. Yeah, those are super, super yeah, dope. I've the, never seen a pair of those, yeah. actually. The soles are crazy. Isn't it? Marbleized and stuff. Yeah. You don't know what I mean. Especially with the nine. You know? Yeah. You yeah. never ever see yeah. something like that. Nines are just classic color. All right, guys. So we had to recharge the camera. I feel like every single time we do videos like this, we have to stop and recharge. I think it's overheating. It. Yeah. Right. All the heat. Um, where do we leave off? Yeah, we left off. We're, we're gonna start with these. Keeping the same with the uh, what was it? G JVC. Yeah. Yeah. We got the futures. 
sample right here. Nice. Now these are really nice. Man. I remember when they first came out, everybody wanted a pair. Hell no, these are nice, dude. Like the the shimmer, the lace is premium. You, know, you get that classic outsole, and this and this one actually came with the actual carbon fiber chain plate. Yeah. None of like the other ones. The other ones came with like the weird. Yeah. Uh, it, was a, it was a weird one. Yeah. yeah. That's a mock up, but it's, I don't know. That's different. Yeah, these these only came out for the players. This is another smaller size. This is like an eleven. Mm -hmm. so, you know, close to my size. Yeah. Another pair from the JVC pack of Jordan Brand Classic is the Oreo Sixes. This is another pair I found. <laughs> yeah, this is another pair from my side. Another yeah, ID. for sure. We were just talking off camera when we were letting the camera uh, mm -hmm. uh, charge. Some kid tried to sell me a fake pair of these. <laughs> Uh, it was the high top version though. Mm -hmm. He tried to sell me a fake pair and then uh, the reason why I knew they were fake is I looked at the, the back of it. Mm -hmm. the, the ones that real, the, well the, the high top version is the black one. The jump man was so bad. And I was like, what the heck are these? He's like, yeah, I'll sell them for you, you know. Just give me, just give me like, I think it was like 30 bucks or something. And I'm like, dude, not even the real pair because around that time the real pair was going for a good amount. And I was like, you get out of here. But I mean, like, the quality, I mean, yeah, the quality is really, really it's good. It's a super clean, low cut. You know, in a size 10, so, 10, some of that. But You're yeah. super, super dope. The tag is right there. You know, sample box. You know. Something you don't never, ever see. Never. Ever. And it, it's really hard to get a box with samples. Yeah. Yeah, it's super hard. I, I know uh, some people, even when they do have the box, they don't like to show it. No. Yeah. Yeah. Some, cause sometimes there's stuff. That yeah, you, you can get I don't in know trouble. If, uh, I'd get in trouble. Yeah. <laughs> I think these, you know, these came out. Right? Yeah. So, you know, you see me. But another, this is another one that came up fun. This is a ginger sample. Mm -hmm. You know, all different. This is all yellow. Yeah. It usually it came with black, yellow, yeah. yellow pattern. But no, this is all yellow. And I had a total sample. Tag. Right there. You know, and as you can see, this pair was worn. You could the sticker would have been in there, but no lace. In there. Whoever had them worn before, yeah, for sure. Sure. But they held, so they held up really, yeah. really good. For I'm sure, kind of happy that they did. I love. I always love ginger Jordans. Yeah, it, it's a different color. Mm -hmm. It's a new, you know, it's vibrant. It's with the green. You know, it's different. Yeah, for sure. You know, I used to have the the cherry wood. And oh the, yeah, I love the cherry wood. I don't know, just. Different color, and then you know, sticking with the same era, you know, we got the face boxes, you know, we got these John, blueberries. What year are these from? These are from 2011. 2011? No, 2001. 2001. 2001. <laughs> My bad. But yeah, I've, I've heard these were supposed to come out. Yeah, a year. lot of people have been saying that, and I feel like this is what they would look like, to be honest. Yeah. yeah. I feel like they, they probably get on spot. Maybe yeah. A tad bit thick, a tad bit higher. I feel like the elephant, the print would be like whatever. Mm -hmm. I love seeing that sole, that yeah. like yellow. Yeah, it looks different. Like it's it's nice. Mm -hmm. You don't see. Yeah, adds a character to it. Yeah. Print. Cool, you know that. These are super super dope. Mm -hmm. You can't go wrong with this. Great yeah. Color. Oh, 11s, I feel like, always hold up pretty good. Yeah, you know, all the OG that's seen, they're peeling and stuff, you know? Yeah, so, for sure. Oh, no. Another pair. Another one that's really slept on is these. And the flints. You know, these did come out with the silver. Yeah, with the silver. I think it's a different color. Yeah, for this sure. Different. This, the quality itself, even looking yeah. at it, it's just super, super you dope. Tell me. The tongue, everything. I feel like they, they really kept the OG shape with this one. They, yeah. they still had the mold as well. For sure. What's, uh, what year is this one? Um, this one's like 2003, 2003. Yeah. So, man, just looking at that quality with the way that it the moves, shoe, yeah. You know, touch, it's plush. It's yeah, super, don't, super dope. We don't get that on one, but any 12 is good, high quality. Yeah. Wow. They last. They're, they're made to last. Oh, yeah, for Pulls sure. On. Another another weak colorway would be you know these thirteens. I love these. I, I have a pair of these, but like I said, my pair is starting to yellow at the at the pods. 
Um, this pair is super clean. It's one of the cleanest pairs that I've uh, seen myself. Yeah, I've, I've tried. I, I have two, you know, one to wear and one to keep pristine. And this is the pristine one. Yeah. It's super, yeah. super dope. Another. This one just never disappoints. It's gonna be the neighbors. And these were, when I got these, were only dead stock, but mm now, -hmm. you know, they're pop, they're yeah. full of pop and stuff. And it's cracking and everything, but the design is so intricate. You know, you get, you get all the numbers from four to one and stuff. And we don't get this laser print on no Nah, these are so dope. I love yeah. these. I love them too. It's awesome. Quality is really, really yeah, dope. Really nice. so. A lot of people ask what happens when an OG sneaker is starting to, you know, give its yeah. last breath. It's that, that air bubble right there. Yeah, it, it pops and, it's, and the paint starts cracking everything. You know, it starts falling apart. For sure. I love it. I love it. I love it too. You can't go on the plastic color or just an intricate design. Uh, that's one thing that I wish Jordan Brand would bring back. Bring back this right here. Yeah, and it's awesome because if you really look at it, there's sample pairs in it. This is a sample six with the third lace hole, I think. And then the all red tongue sample seven. You know, there's a lot of things, little details you don't yeah. see. And when people point them out, it's, it's awesome. Yeah, for sure. Oh, Easter egg pop. Yeah. <laughs> but then, you know, we have some higher up numbers, you know, 20, 22, right? 20 yeah. Points. Oh, I'm not sure. 22. You know, these, these are also, you know, change their air pockets yeah. forever. You know, and it shows you in the back. Yeah. You know, yeah. air, zoom. You know, this is another, this is another pair of really old that I've had since, I don't know, when mm -hmm. my, you know, German Embossic signed a bag and I was sold. Mm -hmm. I don't work through it. It's, you know, these were kind of my custom. Maybe like the Wash of Throne. Yeah. Uh, LeBron Seven. A lot of people back then, like LeBron, used to be dude, dude, everything. Awesome, dude, I used to have collect LeBron, but now I sold half of them because I yeah. don't really use them. Some of them are just too bulky, or you know, they really are comfortable. Yeah, for sure. I used to have a pair of the uh, not, I was about to say Kobe, um, hmm. LeBron uh, Corks. Oh yeah, yeah. No, those, yeah, those. Those are awesome. Yeah. But everybody started taxing. Yeah. Six hundred dollars plus. They weren't that comfortable either. Yeah. They they were. Were. Like I remember the first time I wore them. It took me a minute for me to actually put them on my feet. Because the materials it's different. Yeah. And you know cork cracks. Yeah. It, it was it was super different. I agree. Um and like I said they weren't comfortable at all yeah. either. For sure. Uh so I'm moving to this pile over here. They do have some OG fours from. Um, 89, you know, little kid size. They do have the arch support in there. You know, it's, it's awesome to see stuff like this though inside. You know, little kitty stuff. I do have my size. This for little kids, but you can't go wrong. Either. Yeah, the quality again, it's yeah. it's there. The yeah. shape is there. It's different. Yeah, I love, 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 love stuff. Uh, seeing stuff like yeah. that. And the leather, it's, it's like different. It's not plastic. Yeah. They really took their time when, when they came with, out with shoes yeah. like this. I oh. just imagine being the first people to see this pair. It's like, oh, yeah. what, what, what's the story behind this? Why, yeah. why is this not even? Why is what year is this from? Um, 89. 89. Yeah, this is the original. Wow. Yeah, it's, it's really awesome to see. You know, little kid size. That's super dope. Sticking with the little kid sizes, we have uh, Olympic 7. Um, I got this from the same seller with the 13. I don't know if they he claim to be sampled, but I'm not sure, you know. I have this plastic bag here. They're definitely yeah. OG though, yeah. for sure. They're falling apart. Right? <laughs> they're, they're talking to you, for sure. And then, you know, let's go with the ones. And we got a laser, you know, this is a sample size 14, you know, Bigfoot. And I don't know what they were doing. They yeah. Were size 14 laser sample. But leather is insane. Yeah, right. leather is is definitely. Yeah. It's wow. <laughs> just just going like that, man. But you can tell from so the laser. Soft. Yeah, it's really really yeah. really. One's good. always never disappointing quality. Like from like 2000. 
fall the tire. Here. I don't have any twos over here, but I do have some threes. And it's the mochas, you know. Can't go wrong with this. The OG mochas, yeah, not the re release. Nope. OG right here. And I just love the elephant print, is different. Mm. You know, it's Quality is a bit different. The coloring too from the pair that we released mm -hmm. and the pair now it's, it's a lot different. Yeah, it's, it's, it's more cream. Yeah. Than the, than the white. Yeah, I love that. Brown. Yeah. And we don't get any brown. <laughs> Always reminds me of coffee beans. Right? Yeah. <laughs> like straight coffee. Oh, yeah. <laughs> uh, another one. I feel like this pair. Is, you know, you see this one. Yeah. But I mean, it's such a nice pair to have. You know, it's, it's like. Louis Vuitton of Jordan. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> this would probably be something like like that. Yeah, it, you know, it'd be awesome to do a custom. You know, yeah. Sand off or etch in like the Gucci. Yeah. Like, Louis Vuitton or something. You know, give this a little extra touch. Yeah. Yeah, because I did want to get the jean sixes. Ah, oh, yeah. Just dress them. Yeah. Awesome. I remember you hit me up yeah. about that. I was like, oh, amazing. I want to see how the, what type of jean is. I yeah. want to see if it. You know, if it's actual, it's distressable yeah, or not. It, I feel like it is. I saw someone do it. Yeah, but it looked wrong. Well, well, yeah, it looked really weird. You know, but I do have two pairs of another two more. Yeah, we yeah. Have three in total of the blooms. You know, it's a pair you gotta have for sure. You're not gonna run into these no more. Yeah, you really aren't. Yeah. And you know. if they do, then you know, not in that good condition. No, trash. Uh, another laser. Is these, you know, these are pretty worn. You don't ever see yeah. those. Yeah. And these, these are classic. Gotta love it. What year are, is, are these from? Uh, 2005. 2005. Yeah. All these, they look crazy. These, I love the quality again. Going mm -hmm. into like, a lot of people don't just think it's the random lines, but it has like different details in there. Yeah, they, they're actual shoes that you Yeah. Know, you can wear your shoes on top of your shoes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, these are so dope. Yeah, and, and, lining. and the, the lining goes in with. With the Dalla Souls or, or the Dark Military. Yeah. For sure. And this line and the line so comes with the soul and this yeah. one. This one just comes with the regular soul. Mm -hmm. And I haven't been able to clean these up for a while. Yeah, I usually I feel like when I first got into shoes I would have to clean them every single yeah. time I wear them. And then later down the line I'll be like, eh. Once you start getting to this and my yeah. you can't. Yeah, you, you, you can't. can't. <laughs> And another one, I feel like this, this 7 is a good retro too. Yeah, I for sure. I wear this, you know, I like it. I just got a pair from Chicago sneaking mm -hmm. on for 20 bucks. I know. Yeah. So, yeah, I got I got lucky. <laughs> yeah, no, for real. This one, I got on it cheap, you know, almost brand new. But, you know, I bought them to work. Yeah. So. They're, they're a super, super nice shoe that I feel like goes with everything, to be honest. Oh, yeah. And then I have the Tokyo 10s from 95 or 94. A lot of people don't realize this is different. Yeah. This right here. We got the toe cap. Right? Yeah. So what a lot of people don't know um, about this toe cap right here is that Jordan Brand, I think it was Jordan, right? And Jordan, he didn't like the yeah. toe cap because the way he, they made it for him is because the way he dragged his foot mm -hmm. would tear the shoe up. So they made it so it had an extra piece of leather so it would not tear up. But Jordan didn't like that and they scrapped the shoe. Yeah, they scrapped it. And a lot of, um, what's it called? I saw a baby pair of these. Mm -hmm in chicago i didn't cop it and i was so mad i was like wait i was like i got, I got back home uh to iowa here and i was like wait mm -hmm. i was like hold up that pair had it just like this yeah. i was never able to find the seller yeah. again there's also there's some of the younger with the youth sizes yeah. uh shadow pairs have the telecast yeah and it's really hard to come by the sample version of the actual men's sizes with the toe cap it's even crazy yeah but i do have a project coming in mind soon to have this, the bottom swap mm -hmm. the nine sole with Ooh, the sample. That'd be like, pretty dope. Yeah, like the sample. Yeah. And then it, it looks crazy. For yeah. sure. Yeah, I'm just hoping we're going to come. Yeah. Gonna come on that. For sure. Or, but, you know, all this is kind of sorted by order. You know, it's kind of messy right now. But <laughs> a lot of shoes that are not mm -hmm. seen are these two. Yeah. Um, and it's also a sample pair by the tag. It, all, it has that 99999 nine, 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 nine with Parasite. Yeah. Oh boy. There you go. Yeah. I was probably like, wait, wait. <laughs> yeah, so this is what I wanted to yeah. show people right See, here. This, this is this is what the regular one looked like with the toe box. This is what uh, what they originally looked like. And then uh, they scrapped this 
because of uh, Jordan didn't MJ like it. Won't. Yeah, MJ didn't want this. For sure. I think that's a lot of people don't yeah. realize how it used and to look like. I mean, it's a whole different. Yeah. yeah. It's and a different look. Uh, it's a different look to it, for sure. Yeah. And for sure. Yeah, it, 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 stuff like that, little details like that, yeah. I think that a lot of people don't know. Mm-hmm. Um, there's another special pair of 13s mm-hmm. right here, too. Yeah, that's also a sample. This, this one, you know, everybody knew this one came out in the kids, but no, this is a men's size 12. And, you know, I caught this by accident thinking it was an actual regular one. Yeah. Turns out the sample. But, I mean, this pair is chipping. It's weird. I've never seen pairs chip. Yeah. Leather. Otherwise, it's. It's nice, it's different. You have pink instead of blue, you know. The right. leather on it is yeah. different too. Yeah, it, it, it's it's a different cut. I love it. Yeah, I love, I I love that too. baby blue. Yeah, I do too. It, it, it's a different color too, like I said. It, it's, it still goes with like Jordan's color jeans. Yeah, you know, for sure. Um, another pair of four that we should touch on is Ovio, you know, the, the Stingray. You gotta love it. Man. Yeah. yeah. It goes with everything. Yeah. It's so nice. It's, it's, it's like a jury sneaking and you can wear the tuxedo on somewhere nice or something. Yeah, for sure. And then, you know, we always gotta have a classic and the bread. And this is the long tall open. You know, just go down cleaning it up, have the lace them, have the way to wear them. It's been snowing a lot. So yeah, uh, here in Iowa. Hard bread, yeah. yeah. A lot of people don't realize like the weather here. We can't wear everything that we want to wear because you, you don't want to mess yeah. up the shoe. I always be looking at the weather. Like, oh, it's like you have to wear, yeah, you have to wear something yeah. else. You know, you know, also have the concords. You gotta have a pair of concords in your collection. I feel like too. You know, it's something. It's, it's classic. classic. It's yeah, it's classic. You cool to send you one and be like, you know, these. Yeah, Jordan. Yeah, Jordan. You know, we have. 14. Another color we don't see a lot. Ginger. Yeah. Any more ginger? Any more ginger stuff? <laughs> this pair, you know, is wearable. You know, I got the blue blue. I love these. I wear them. You know, very rare shoe you know, so mm-hmm. I've heard these were originally sample or something, and you know, they released something for sure. Just yeah, I have it. I wanted to go in depth to some uh, of these right here. Mm-hmm. A lot of people think they're ugly. A lot of people don't like them. Um, I know. It's, yeah. it's a nice color. These are super, super like, dope. On the sand color. Uh huh. Yeah, I see the light. Yeah, I, these are like a woman's size. Yeah. You don't see these a lot. I did. I was gonna buy a pair of these. Mm-hmm. They're starting yeah, to talk too. Apart, yeah, <laughs> they're really old. Yeah. I was gonna buy a pair of these. The but green is awesome. You, know, you just gotta have the green. Yeah. And also have a pair of the Sendit. You know, they're you know, all different colorways from 2004 to 2006. You know, you gotta love, you know, love the brown, the inspiration from it from the car. Yeah. You know, it looks nice. You gotta be careful with yeah, them. Yeah, <laughs> you know, they're so old and fragile. And this, this one right here is a little something special. It's a soul fly. You know, you probably might know what this is. Yeah. Not the one with the name on it. Just recognize. Yeah, I've never seen these in person. These are the actually. ostrich skin. Everything. This is pair 1,349. Nice. Yeah, I haven't seen a pair of these ever, so this is the first time I've ever seen them. Yeah, it's yeah. awesome. And just seeing all these PEs, like the babies and stuff. You gotta have a you gotta have a low. Yeah. These remind me of the Cheerio LeBrons, I wanna say. Mm. This the the all um, the honey nut Cheerio ones. The B there it, it was the exact same colorway of this. And um <gasps> the runtime, right? Yeah, gotta yeah. have the honey, right? Yeah, gotta yeah. have the honey. Yeah, the exact like, same color. Yeah, dude, those are awesome too. Like they're all white and then the mm-hmm. black, yeah. yeah. It's super super nice. Black and yellow, yeah. That's what it is. Mm-hmm. <laughs> The man who started it all. Yeah. Legendary. Started something. Yeah. 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 And, you know, staying with the samples. I've never, ever seen anyone with this. No, nothing. No info, nothing. No pictures, anything. This is a sample. 
uh, Lunar Max right here. And she's just rolling in there. <laughs> you know, this is a real comfort. I wore these. This is so comfortable. Like, these are nice. Yeah. And, you know, not for sale. Probably at Nike. You know, I took off the insole to sh show you guys that it does have the tracking thing in there. I like these a lot. I've never seen these. I've never either. Really. And that was not, uh, for me, I think they're one of one. They're super sick. Yeah. I've seen samples of the pair, but not this color specifically. Thing. These are super nice. They're really comfortable too. Yeah, they look pretty comfortable. Yeah, not in the blood. For sure, a lot of people don't realize this is, this right there itself is big. Yeah. It's super nice seeing that. And, and it's and it's even rare when you see it with Jordan. You know? Yeah. The Jordan's like, whoa, You whoa. see that, it's a big deal. <laughs> um, another shoe that I just copped because it reminds me of the Pigeon Duck. Oh, I've yeah. I've always wanted to get this pair customized to have like, the Pigeon Duck. But this pair don't fit me no more. Yeah, you no. Know? Dunks have gone up crazy. And this pair, I haven't seen a colorway in this one. Mm -hmm. I don't know. What's wrong with these? But I like these. Yeah. <laughs> you know, and sticking with LeBron's, you know, I've said I've worn LeBron's. Uh, another meet up pair, you know, I ran in, so. They're nice. Yeah. yeah. And, you know, they're boot, they're boot like. Yeah. And they have, I think, the zoom in there or whatever. Mm -hmm. So it's like really comfortable, dude. Yeah. I recommend a pair of these. And for those big people. Yeah. <laughs> for sure. Man. This pretty much this is all mine. You know, I've worked for it. Wow. Nice. Yeah, I, mean, I like them a lot. For sure. These are my favorite. I, I, I love I just every single time because I know we filmed a couple of them. A lot of people wanted to see more because you did get a couple new pieces in there. Mm -hmm. Um it's just appreciating the the, yeah, the just, history behind it. Yeah, like, I don't know. It seems different colorways, you know, samples or ideas that kind of came true in yeah. the house, like you know, all yellow bubble sixteen, you know, the house, you know, or another unknown colorway of the sixes. You yeah. know, there's also a carmine sample with the sport blue. So yeah, I saw that. Yeah, um, new sample with the eyelids. Mm. All different things, and then. You know, we do have you know, regular pairs like Wolf Gray. Those are one of my favorite yeah. pair, my first pair of Jordans. Mm -hmm. Yeah, there have also been a couple other sample pairs, different colorways like the, the navy blue. Yeah. You know, those are really rare. Mm -hmm. you know, I really like those too, but you can't go wrong with you know, classic pairs like these. For sure. Well, I appreciate it, man, as always. Mm -hmm. uh, where can people find you on Instagram? Uh, it will be Imano Ariano23. Um, it also shows up a Soli Stash 23. So yeah. Nice, nice. I appreciate it, man. Yeah. As always, uh, thank you for allowing us to film yeah, this. Uh, thank you for showing up. You for know, sure. Showing, uh, yeah. You know, <laughs> I appreciate it, man. Um, of course, you can follow us on Instagram at 99. Um, go ahead and give us a follow and mm -hmm. um, subscribe. More content coming to this channel. I've been working really, really hard to bring you guys really good content. Stuff you don't see. And, and that's all what this this channel and is truly about. In small, in small places like this, like Iowa. Like, yeah, for nothing. Well, exactly. And that's one thing. When we live in Iowa, a lot of people have asked us, where do you guys live? Where are you guys from? Yeah, Iowa, I've never heard of that. So um, I appreciate you guys as always. I believe as the moment of right now, we're almost to 800 subscribers. So make sure you're subscribing. We're growing and growing frequently. I appreciate the love and support. And uh, see you guys yeah, on the next one. Yeah, girl. Peace.